United Aircraft Corporation UAC, unveiled the second prototype of the Sukhoi S-70 Okotnik combat drone. This version of the aircraft is said to have flat jet exhaust nozzles, a feature which will enhance its stealth characteristics. The manufacturer also said that the drone will receive a new ground control station, which will increase its effectiveness. The work of Okotnik is one of the main directions for Sukhoi and UHC. Yuri Slaysar, general director of UHC, said at the ceremony, according to a press release published by Russian state conglomerate Rostec. Today, we did our best to finish testing, S-70, Aero Time, and start serial production, added Slaysar. In August 2019, UHC revealed that the vehicle's final design will feature a flat exhaust nozzle a feature that will reduce its radar and infrared signature. This feature was also present on several previous American and Russian test aircraft, as well as the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor fighter jet. Although the nozzle is not visible in photos published by UAC or by its parent company Rostec, glimpses of the feature have been seen in several news segments on Russian television. According to UAC, serial production of the drone should start in 2024, with the first deliveries expected in the same year. Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu visited the Novosibirsk Sukhoi Aircraft Production Association factory on August 5, 2021. He inspected the assembly line of the Su-34 tactical bomber, as well as work being carried out on the S-70 Okotnik Hunter combat drone. We hope that by 2022, the work will be completed and we will be able to sign, as is customary in the armed forces now, large long-term contracts for drones, the Russian defense minister said at a meeting after the inspection. This is necessary so that the industry knows how to build its plans for the next 10 years. In August 2020, the Ministry of Defense told the United Aircraft Corporation to accelerate the experimental design work and adjust the schedule to the maximum to meet the deadline. The aircraft was originally slated to be in its weapons testing stage in 2024, with deliveries to take place the following year. The target now is for the first shipments to occur as early as 2024. The Okotnik drone is powered by an AL-31 turbojet engine and is expected to fly at a speed of 1,000 km slash head for a range of 6,000 km. It is equipped with electro-optical targeting, radio, and other types of reconnaissance equipment, according to the Russian Defense Ministry. The S-70 is supposed to eventually operate in collaboration with the fifth-generation Su-57 fighter jets to expand the latter's radar field. It must also be able to use its stealth capabilities to designate remote targets for its lead aircraft without being detected. Its two internal bays should hold up to 2.8 tons of guns, in January 2021, the S-70 reportedly destroyed a ground target during a test, using a 500-kilogram unguided bomb dropped from its internal chamber. In late July 2021, a source at the military-industrial complex told Russia's TSS news agency that a two-seat version of the Su-57 capable of controlling four S-70 drones at the same time is being developed. <laughs>